Hello today. I'm Alakananda Ma, Ayurvedic doctor and principal of Alandi Ayurveda Gurukula, a unique apprenticeship style Ayurveda school in Boulder, Colorado, offering two and four year programs. So um, I'd like to talk today about healthy diet, healthy gallbladder. One of my goals in life is to get through life with my gallbladder, thus being the first woman in several generations of my family to do so. Of course, we don't know yet because I'm still alive, but I have made it uh, to over 70 with my gallbladder, which uh, didn't happen for my mother, my grandmother or my great grandmother. So let's see how it's going to go. So uh, gallstones are made of cholesterol. So having gallstones to the extent that we have them nowadays is a function of Western diets. I remember my grandmother, Nanny, she would eat a typical British working class diet of meat and potatoes, like meat with lumps of fat. She really enjoyed her meat, dripping and potatoes, bread, cakes, eclairs, pastries. Eventually, my parents managed to get her to have frozen peas, which was as close as she would get to eating vegetables. So eating too much meat in your diet is definitely one way that you can have too much cholesterol in your diet, too much meat, too much eggs and bacon, too much fatty foods, having too much deep fried food will also raise the amount of cholesterol in your diet. Then it's not only what we're eating too much of, the eggs and bacon and meat and fries and all these like fatty foods. It's also what we're not eating enough of, like how Nanny wouldn't eat vegetables. Because then we're not getting enough soluble fiber. And it's that soluble fiber that's pulling the cholesterol out of our body into the digestive tract, binding it, pulling it out, getting rid of it so it doesn't hang around in the bile and form cholesterol stones. So we want to eat plenty of fruits and vegetables. Sadhananda and I, just for our brunch, had kitchery with some garden vegetables and lots of bitter goods in. So we got our brunch vegetables in a little bit. Eat plenty of fruits and vegetables. Colorful foods, as I always say, colorful foods show you're getting your phytonutrients. Eat your whole grains and your legumes. That means eat your kishiri. Eat your dal. Eat your legumes. Try to limit those refined starches. It's the refined starches that don't have any ability to pull out cholesterol and are just causing the cholesterol to build up in your body. So overall, you can see the brain healthy diet, the heart healthy diet, that's the diet that's healthy for your gallbladder. And when so many people do have gallstones and so many people do develop gallbladder disease, it's worth thinking about another benefit of your beautiful Ayurvedic diet, your beautiful vegetarian diet, your beautiful pescatarian diet, all your beautiful spices that you have in your diet. Another benefit is it's going to help your gallbladder. Isn't that amazing? 
So yes, uh, cut back on the meat, cut back on the fatty fried foods, cut back on the cookies and the pastries. Enjoy your dolls, your kitcheries, your soups, your vegetables, and your whole grains. Have a healthy gallbladder and enjoy your life. That's it for now. Don't forget to click the like button. And if you're not already subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Namaste.